Faceoff is set to go. Referee Shilavec is ready to drop the puck. Puck is dropped, and we are underway. This has been one we've been waiting for for a while, and it's time to finally see what the payoff is all about. And the long-range shot goes off target. From off the wall and onto a stick. Massachusetts has possession of it now. From the slot, makes the save. What a reaction with the blocker. And another stop. Tutu's lugging the puck. Now a quick pass to Johnson. Great positioning by the defender. And they'll dump it in. Sets up from Gretzky's office. Kansas City's got a hold of it against the wall. And that's intercepted. Paco's got it in the offensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Bork. And he slides it quickly to Johnson with the steal. Oh, quickly the road team gets an upper hand here and always a little more uncomfortable for the home team when they have to play from behind. Massachusetts has the game's first goal and it's almost a collective by scoring here early. Really quiet in the building. I don't think anybody expected this game to start like this. Slides the puck to Letty. Here's a short pass to Letty. Moves the puck. Moves it to Bork. Did he ever rock him in the open ice? Fanoff's got it in the defensive end. 
forces the turnover in the neutral zone. Great glove save! We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. The Aces lead it 1-0. Letty's won the faceoff. Pushes it across to Rene. And now he moves it quickly to Letty. That's off a stick. Tutu's moving the puck through his own zone. And now he angles it across to Johnson. Sends it deep inside the offensive zone. Quick pass to Paco. And that shot goes nowhere as the lane was filled. There's the physical side. Massachusetts gains a hold of the puck against the boards. Kansas City's trying to shake the defender. He's in, all alone. Flips it across, and he elects to explore his options. Too much traffic in the lane. Quick feed to Paco. Beautiful cross-ice feed inside the zone. Oh, that's a good hit. That goes off a twig. Rips it. Nowhere for that shot to go through. Stones him in front. Well past the midway mark of this period, we've got a 1-0 hockey game thus far. Good read by the winger as the two setters tie up. Scores! His second of the night! Now well, things go well for you if you're scoring multiple times in a game. This has been a terrific night for him. Massachusetts can build on this lead here with still plenty of time to go here in the first. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Passes it to Lopez. The Aces have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Slides it across to Letty. Takes the pass. Bank pass off the boards. Moved in front. Great heads up play in the defensive zone. Kansas City's coaches constantly work on this in practice. And that's to be in the right position to intercept pucks on the middle of the ice. They've done a terrific job tonight. Massachusetts still has time to work here in this first period to increase this lead. And he slides it quickly to Lopez. And that one's picked off. Shot right in front. Comes up with the stick save. Had to be sharp. That's a great A chance. In front and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Massachusetts has been the better team offensively. More shots and as a result, more goals. Letty's won the faceoff deep inside the offensive zone. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Slides the pass over to JC. Smart heads up play to intercept the pass. Dumped into the cross side. Massachusetts takes possession along the wall. Paco's got it in the offensive end. Moves it quickly over to Bork. Puts him hard into the wall. Massachusetts has it near the wall. Referee singling for a penalty. Looks like we got a hooking call coming up. Here comes the call from the official. And it's going to be two minutes for hooking on the call. A lot of people debate, is this a lazy penalty, the hook? I don't know if it's lazy all the time, but it's a penalty of being out of position. Your stick's parallel to the ice. You get called all the time. Now over to Tutu. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Massachusetts gains possession shorthanded. Gets it out of his own end. Retrieves the puck, trying to kickstart this power play. On the attack along the boards. Forks taking a nasty whack, and that's going to draw a penalty. Here comes the call. Renee's going to go to the box for the next five as he gets handed a major. After the officials get together here, James, they decide it's a major penalty, and I think they've made the correct call. I'm with you on that. Here inside the defensive zone, they get the puck and manages to clear the zone. Passes the puck over to Lopez. Along the half wall with the puck. Hammers it on net. Shuts him down. Get that slop out of here. He makes the stop, and there's no rebound. Off in the corner it is. Grabs the puck right in front and tries to escape the pressure. Paco's hungry for that third one. He's got two. He took that quick little pass. Now he's a dangerous player. Carries it in. Lifts the stick and takes the puck. Rocks him on the play. 
The first period is all said and done with as the horn sounds. It's 2-0 after the opening frame. Pretty good start for one side, not so much for the other. of regulation still to play. We're looking forward to it. Hopefully you are too. just moments away from the start of period number two. Kansas City's power play gets back to work here as we are underway in the period. They win the draw. Quick shot. Long jam in front. That's broken up. The Mavericks played along the boards. And it comes up with the save. Gets it out of his own end. Tries to get this man advantage going from their own end now. Here's a chance on the doorstep. Kansas City's got a hold of it along the wall. Massachusetts takes possession at center. Slides it to Paco. And that one's stolen at center ice. The Mavericks have been in such good position all night long. Stick position is critical as they continue to intercept a lot of passes. We're still in the early stages of this period. And it's a comfortable 2-0 lead we're looking at right now. Takes a shot. Oh, absolutely owns the crease tonight. Try. Oh, look at that. Here we go. We got a penalty coming up right here. Paco's done everything here except pull the other guy's gloves off. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. Five minutes they're putting up on the board here. That's a long time to be shorthanded. The players really put his team in a bad spot. Here we go. A lengthy five-on-three power play looms. The biggest mistake a power play can make with five minutes on the board is to think, oh, we can get multiple goals here. You have to be urgent. You have to get the puck to the net. You have to wear the penalty killers down. Can't connect. Stick save. Certain saves are more difficult than others. This one right from the slot is turned aside. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. Lays the body. Kansas City's gained possession along the boards. And he comes up with it. Shot blocked in front. Here's the chance to set up now. And now it's over to Tutu. And that slides right out to center ice. Massachusetts gets the puck near the boards. Rene is going to play it to the corner. Quick feed down low. Here's a short pass to Lopez. Moves it around along the half wall. Takes a shot. Too many bodies in the way. Score! Shot. Power play goal! Uh, critical for them to get on the board with the extra man. They move the puck well and they're able to capitalize. Kansas City's back to set a race and now it is just a deficit of one. What a difference just the one goal makes in the way that you look at the game. What makes you think is possible. They only need one more to even this up. Massachusetts gets a hold of the puck shorthanded. And sends it just out of reach. Lopez takes the puck. Slides the puck over. And that puck leaves the zone. Ref's arm goes up in the air. Looks like we got a hooking call coming up. Let's get the official decision. Panuf's getting two for hooking. As soon as he stops skating, he has to reach out with his stick. Parallel to the ice, it's going to get called most every time. They'll have a lot of time to work with this five on three. 
This is a pretty simplistic power play. They like to get the puck, shoot it, crash the net, get it back, and shoot it again. What a great time to have a man advantage as they trail by one. Grabs the puck and moves on out here with this man advantage. Here's the pass! The Aces get a hold of the puck along the boards and manages to clear the zone. The Mavericks gain possession in their own end. Grabs the puck here in their own end. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. Moves the puck along the half wall. Put the hard hat on here. What a hit. Takes the feed from the left side. With possession along the wall. Missed opportunity by the power play unit as they fail to execute, still trailing by one. Nice defensive robbery with the stick. Can't hang on after that hit. Kansas City's got the puck along the boards. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. Still lots of time left in the period. It's 2-1. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Johnson's got it across the line. Takes that pass back at the point. Tipped in front. Oh, what a stop. I think it's a chance for a breather here as he hangs on and covers the puck up. Who, for the players or for you? Well, you know, I won't complain. Here in the back half of this period, it's 2-1. Off the draw, and a nice job locking up his opponent. Massachusetts has it in the open ice. Good heads-up play in the defensive zone. The Mavericks get a hold of the puck in their own end. Offside is the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the offensive zone. off here in the neutral zone and we are back underway now he slides it up to jc slides the puck near the front of the net denied by the goaltender and as the puck is dropped they win the draw here inside the defensive zone Lopez plays it now, and it's a quick pass to Tutu. Big time stop there. Massachusetts has possession of it now. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. And a solid job tying up his opponent. Tries to get it over to J.C. And that banks off a stick. Takes control of the puck. Puck picked up by Johnson. Intercepts it at center. Slides the puck over to Tutu. And he sends it across to Johnson. Ahead of steam now towards the front. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Late goings of this period. It's a 2-1 game. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. The Aces have it from their own end. Receives the pass. Grabs the puck at center. Moves it to Letty. Whacks it into the offensive zone. Good hit on the play. Huge steal in his own end. Takes the cross ice pass. Oh, reads it perfectly. Here's a chance. Hammers the one timer. Denies him on the play. Moved up ahead here in the neutral zone. Oh, what a dangle. Makes the save as he got a blocker on it. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. 
slides it across to JC. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. One timer. Horn sounds to end the second period. 2 1 is where we sit after 40 minutes of play. Welcome back, everyone. Both teams lined up at center ice, and we are ready to get this third period underway. Here we go. Put up or shut up for both teams here in this third period. We are underway. Ray Ferraro is between the benches at ice level. Ray, we've got 40 minutes played so far. How have you viewed things? Kansas City's been a step slow almost all game. They haven't had the puck very much. They're losing. If that's going to change, they've got to get the puck and hold on to it much more. Feeds it down low. Off his stick. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Moves the puck inside the offensive zone. And as he opts to freeze the puck, we get a whistle. Starting to look like a little bit of a fire drill in the zone, so this is a good play. Lots of time left in this period. It's a 2-1 hockey game. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Massachusetts skins a hold of the puck against the boards. Lugs the puck into the offensive zone corner. Centering pass. Here's an offensive chance. Right out in front. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Oh, here we go. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Takes the pass as he banks it off the wall. Nice defensive robbery on that. Kansas City's got it now. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. From the left side, takes it at center. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Shot! Here's a blast! And that shot dies in traffic. Pushes it across to Bork. Handles the puck. Lacanitz is sliding the puck behind the net. Shot from the wall with the stop. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period, we've got a 2-1 game. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Now a quick pass to JC. The Mavericks gain control of the puck against the wall. And he passes it up ahead to Johnson. Johnson's got it along the wing. Picked up along the wall by Rene. Looks to get the puck over to Johnson. Johnson's got the puck in his own zone. And he slides it quickly to Juju. Slides the puck across to Lopez. Picks up the puck in his own end. Taken by Bork. Great defensive effort with the strip. Right to the middle! From the slot, wrist shot, and scores! What a shot! Sometimes for the goalie to catch up to the pass, it's too quick. It's one timed into the net. Past the midway mark of the frame, James and Ray with you tonight. The Aces have recently taken a two goal lead. They'd love to build on it. Big time defensive play. 
time of the goal. And now he moves it quickly to Lopez. Forces the turnover in the neutral zone. Hammers it on net. Off a stick. Kansas City's got a hold of it against the wall. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Denied by the goaltender. A lot on the line here in this offensive zone faceoff. Borks won the draw. Tutu's going to play it against the half wall. Massachusetts has it near the wall. Pass stolen in the open ice. Along the wing up the neutral zone. The Aces look to start the transition game. Pass to Rene. Massachusetts takes possession of the neutral zone. Takes the puck at the point. JC's got it against the boards. Sends the pass over. Here he is, trying to get loose. And he's signaling penalty shot here on the play. As the defender's chasing him here, he gets his stick tied up in the shooter's feet. Trips him up and it costs a penalty shot. There it is. Oh, I love it, James. Best advice I ever got on a penalty shot is don't go anywhere near the bench. Too many different opinions. Collect your thoughts and make your play. Kansas City's come back with a big one here in the third. Grind away, dig away, now you got a chance. Only trailing by one goal. Scored by number 94. Time of the goal. 18 minutes, Hammers a shot, and that's blocked. Hangs onto the puck. Comes up with the stop. Move to the middle, and that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Well, that'll get a response. We got a delayed penalty coming up here as the ref's hand goes up in the air. Paco's ready to go. Apparently, the other guy doesn't want anything to do with him. Paco's going to get five for that one. You like this call? I do like it, but I can see the frustration and disappointment on his own face. He knows he's made a bad play here. Quick pass to Bork. Massachusetts will try to kill a few seconds off this penalty. Gets it out of his own end. Trying to get something going here with this man advantage as they start from their own end. And now he moves it to Johnson. Moves with the puck at the corner. Here's a blast! Blocked in traffic. Kansas City's got control of it now here in the offensive end. The arms up. There's the whistle. And boy, look at the time here for a penalty coming up. Pretty cut and dry with a tripping call here. Yeah, but James, every player argues the tripping call because you feel like your stick was in the right place and the other guy stepped on it. Never your fault. And it looked like there was some late moment lobbying there and it didn't yeah, work. it doesn't work. No, though. done. And that goes off a player in front. There it is, final horn sounds. We are all over here with this one. Puck possession, the name of the game in this one tonight, Ray. Really good job. They had the puck, they kept the puck, and when they didn't have a play, they seemed to put it into a place where they were going to get it next. They controlled the play, and therefore controlled the game. 